What is going on guys? Evo here and we are back with some more ASA. I hope everyone is having a great day. So this episode we are going to be venturing into our first cave which is uh, kind of exciting but also scares me a bit. We're going to be bringing the Carno in and it should be able to handle everything in there. I've also got some journeyman torches crafted up, a bunch of arrows, some extra water, some extra food. So I think we are just going to kind of head over to the cave. Now it's located right next to the volcano, I believe in this area. So let's hop on the Carno here and make our way over. And there's actually another reason that I want to go do this cave. I would love to tame up a dung beetle. That would be amazing for the farm. So hopefully we can get that done. I'm kind of wondering if we maybe grab these Fiomias in front of me and just get one of them for poop. I feel like that would be extremely useful just so we can easily tame up the dung beetle. We can just have the Fiomia follow us and maybe grab some stim berries along the way as well. Oh, we've cheesed off that fairy. Okay, we're going to have to deal with you, I think. I don't know what level you are. Okay, the fairy's stuck and it's peaceful now, so we're going to get back to what we were doing. Okay, so we've got the Fiomia. Amazing. Let's go ahead and kill this raptor before it kills our friend, our little baby friend. You've just been absolutely decimated. 430 damage for like a headshot or whatever you want to call it. A crit hit. Not sure why that's a thing, but I uh, love it. Oh, there's a little baby parasaur running around. That's kind of sad. Its mother is probably dead somewhere. And there's a stego here with a lot of babies too. Interesting. Are you a good level stego? You're level 50. Okay, not great. Not amazing, but there is a blue drop, which I do want to grab, which we will definitely grab. Why are bugs so annoying? They always bug me. And our Fiomia is slowly catching up. If you could just speed it up a tiny bit, that would be great. I don't want this drop to disappear. There is a Carno nearby. Hopefully it's not going to be like a super big level. What is it picking on? Oh, it's picking on a Dodo. It's only a 25. We should easily kill this. And what does the drop have? Do you have anything amazing? Oh, you do actually. Okay. A journeyman Anki Saddle Blueprint. I will absolutely take that. A journeyman Hyenodon Meat Pack. Uh, we got some vegetables. We got some soap, trank arrows, crystal, a stimulant, and narcotic. I will happily take all those things. Very useful. And our Fiomia has caught up. That's amazing. Let's just head up the hill here. Is there going to be like a nice easy way up or do we have to go around? It looks like we have to go around. Oh no, our Fiomia is under attack. There's a raptor on it somewhere. I can't actually see because the foliage is too strong. Okay, we got it. It's fine. Oh, is there a scorpion coming too? Let's just deal with that. Okay, anything else? No, I think we're okay. I think we need to be on the other side of this little hill. So let's just grab the stone here, get it out of the way. And we've been attacked by a saber tooth. Oh, two. Okay, okay. Uh, where's my Carno? Where's my Carno? Carno, let me on you. Thank you. Perfect. Totally not panicking. Everything's fine. That was a 125 saber tooth. Ooh, that would have been nice to tame up. Okay, we have officially made it to the cave entrance. And we're going in. Uh, no problems. Loaded it in. Arno is fitting fine. Let's just try and get through this cave here. Clear it out and then find a dung beetle. And then we'll come back for the poop. Uh, so far it is pretty clear. I'm actually going to change my view distance here. So I can not clip into the ceiling every 12 seconds. There's, uh, there's no creatures in here. That's very strange. Oh, here we go. Here are some creatures. Holy moly, the echo. The echo is strong. Okay, one down. This one's a 135. That's a, uh, big level. But we should be able to deal with you. 
Yes, you're gone. Okay. And there's an explorer note right here, which I will take. Oh, there's so many things. There's so many things in the cave. Holy moly. Okay. Okay, we gotta back it up. Oh, this was a mistake. Oh, this was a big mistake. Okay, run. Why are there so many things right there? Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, please help. Wow, there was a lot of that room. All right, we're just healing up the Cardo here. That was uh, a very close call, but we're going to be okay. Hopefully things have spread out a little bit and we can kind of go back in and deal with things one at a time. Okay, there's some spiders, one down, and the other ones are kind of running away. As long as the bats don't come over here, we should be okay. Uh, we got another scorpion. This isn't so bad. Everything's under control again. Still kind of afraid about the bats, but we're doing good. Okay, we've got one bat on us. Uh, we're just going to back up a little bit. Going to kind of spread these guys out. Hopefully this one's going to follow me. It will. Let's just eat you up. They hit so hard. Which is kind of ridiculous. I am worried about mega rabies. But hopefully we just get lucky with that. Oh, we got mega rabies. Just as I said it. Okay, hopefully we don't get mega rabies again, because if we do, we are in huge trouble. Can't really afford to deal with that. Uh, this bat is just stuck in the wall, so we're going to eat you. Easy peasy. Oh, now you're not stuck in the wall. That's not what we want. Now let's head back up here if we can. There we go. That one is dead. We're slowly moving up in the world. Slowly getting things done. I did not think that this game was going to be this intense. But it's been pretty crazy so far. Alright, we got another bat coming our way. You're only a level 15. You're gone. That was nice and clean. So we've got another bat to our left. And, oh, we have a dung beetle to our right. Okay. With a drop. Let's try and deal with this bat here if we can. Let's make it quick. Oh, it's a 150. Okay, it's not going to be quick. Not going to be quick at all. He's actually hurting us. Let's head back up to our open area. Okay, are we safe in here now? What level is this dung beetle? Uh, level 20. That's actually fine. It doesn't need to be like a super big level. We got another explorer note here. Okay, let's see what's in this drop here. Ooh. Uh, okay, not as exciting as I thought it was right off the bat. We got a Mastercraft turtle saddle, and, uh, we got an Ascendant Cloth Pants blueprint. So, not great. Definitely not great. We're gonna leave the Dung Beetle there for the moment. And hopefully come back for him. Let's finish this cave. Oh, there's a spider right there. I'm surprised that spider didn't come and attack me. When we were doing the loot and the explorer note. Okay, we got a bunch of bats here. We got to be a little careful. My butt is getting bit. Ooh, and we just got the mega rabies again. Okay, that's not ideal. One bat dead. And two bats dead, maybe? Possibly? Really soon? Oh, come on. Let me just get off my butt, man. It's my butt. And you're not allowed on it. I really hope we don't die to Mega Rabies. It shouldn't kill us. I probably could make a bed outside the cave. You know what? Let's go do that. It's better to be safe than sorry. I should have done it from the start. I didn't realize how mean everything was going to be. Okay. We've got the bed down. We can respawn. Let's head back in. Okay. Bunch of bats here. Kind of intimidating. Uh, we got one on us. And we got two. Can we bring you guys up here? Here we go, back to the amazing open area where everything is so open. It's so easy to attack. Uh, we got mega rabies. Okay, that's gonna kill us. Uh, but hopefully we can get these bats in time. Okay, one bat dead. The second one is close. I can see the blood, I think. It's hard to kind of tell. I'm gonna be honest. I feel like they don't get as red as they used to. Oh yeah, that's definitely gonna kill us. Uh, we might as well just pump some health while we wait. 
All right, back in the cave we go, and it should basically be clear now. I am kind of sad that we died. Oh, no. Did that dung beetle move? No, it did not. It's actually a second dung beetle, which is huge. Let's bring these mean guys up here. If I get mega rabies again, I'm going to cry. Please don't give me mega rabies. I don't want it in my life. I don't need it in my life. Okay, we're just getting bullied. That is dead. And our throw is dead. Nice. Okay, feeling good. Feeling confident. Can't really eat that body. That's okay. What level is this dung beetle? Are you an amazing level? Level 50. Okay, so not amazing. A third dung beetle. Oh, I just bit that one. I didn't mean to. Oh, I'm so sorry. So we've got like four dung beetles around here. We're almost at the bottom of the cave. It's pretty clear at the moment. Except for, oh, this last room is going to have a lot of bats. I have a feeling. A lot of, lot of bats. There's a spider behind me. Uh, can we eat you through the wall? Is that going to be a thing? Yes, it is. Okay, you've been eaten. Unfortunate for you. Do we just have the one bat there? I think so. There's another dung beetle beside me. We could have like super dung beetles. I think that one's a 130. Oh, this is a 140 bat though. Oh, we got mega rabies. I'm really tired of the mega rabies. The cave has not been that bad other than mega rabies. That is like the only thing holding us back. And it's truly unfortunate that it's a thing. I'm just going to keep pressing forward even with the mega rabies. Okay. So that hit, from what I remember from the original game, has a ton of piranha in it. So we want to avoid it at all costs. We've got an Arthro here. That's fine. Arthro, come over. We can uh, be your friend. We probably wouldn't even have to kill this thing. We could just walk over to the other side of the cliff and it would fall in. But we might as well just kill it took our armor which I'm not super thrilled about and we are so close to dying are we actually gonna die oh please don't die oh my goodness what HP are we on three we have three HP oh we can't get mega rabies again it's just not gonna be a thing that we can do we've got a woosah for a moment oh there's a lot of bats Ooh, that's intimidating don't like that. I can hear the artifact pulsating like crazy. I just want to deal with this scorpion, and I think we can kind of slip into the right and avoid those bats. Let's just eat you up and then eat up this second scorpion. There we go. One dead. And two dead. Are there any bats on this other side? Doesn't seem like it. We're just going to walk in real quick have a little scan uh i think that scorpion's gonna come over here so let's just be ready to fight it i saw it moving around what is it doing are you coming over here or are you not coming over here i'm not gonna go get that artifact until i know exactly what it's gonna do oh this scorpion is stressing me out beyond belief just come on over man just let me eat your face let that be a thing, please. Okay, that Arthro's coming. Uh, you're in the water. Can we eat you? We can't eat you in there. Okay. Uh, your mate boosted, which means there's another one. Yep, yeah, right behind me. Let's eat you as well. Chomp you up. You are almost dead. Really close, I think. I want to say it's fine. And you're dead? Okay. I think we're going to have just a free trip to the artifact. Let's just grab you. And boom. Our first artifact of ASA. Holy moly. That was intense. Let's get the heck out of here. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's bats. Okay, sorry. So I'm just going to head back up. Grab some poop from our amazing Fiomia that's just chilling up here. All right. I've got five large poop on me. Thanks to the Fiomia. We're just going to head right back in here. I don't want to wait too long, otherwise everything's going to respawn. And that is not what we want. 
And we could start grabbing up a couple dung beetles. Go ahead and put it in our last slot. Just like that. And feed you. Okay, that one's only going to need two. Beautiful. Let's grab another one here. Uh, there should be a dung beetle here, maybe? Somewhere? There was another one. I'm going to bring the Cardo down here and see if I can maybe kill this bat. Because there was one, like, right on the cliff here. These bats are absolutely ruining me. One dead. And this guy should be gone. Oh, wait. There's a dung beetle attacking me. Where did that dung beetle come from? Let's bring it up. Oh, there's another dung beetle here. Wait, what's happening? I'm so confused. Okay, so they must have been in the walls because I hit one accidentally down there fighting. And now there's one here. There's another one there. Well, I, uh, I'm happy that we've got dung beetles back. I guess. I'm going to go for this higher level one. It's a 125, so we're going to need some extra poop for you. That's not a big deal. We can do that. We can get your poop. I have 100% faith. Uh, can we tame you? We can. First dung beetle done. Amazing. Should we go for this dung beetle too? Do we have three? That might not be a bad idea. We'll tame you up. Grab all of the dung beetles that we can. Uh, we're going to pick you up. We're going to bring you kind of towards the entrance of the cave. I'm going to grab some more poop and we will come back down and hopefully finish you guys up. Okay, so something strange is happening. My dung beetles seem to be plummeting into the center of the earth. I don't understand why that's a thing. Maybe just because the area is not loaded, but they are, uh, they're still going. One's at 10,000 meters. Which is kind of crazy. Hopefully they're going to be in the cave once we get back down there. And you guys are... Gone? It seems like. Are they still plummeting? Yep, they're still falling. Uh, I wonder if I can maybe like try and hit this other dung beetle that was here. Get them to pop back up. Wherever it was. I don't actually remember. What if we attack like the dung beetle that was here? Okay. Oh! Oh, there's a... Okay. I wasn't ready for that. Oh, there was a sleepy boy on the rock. Wow, that was scary. Wow, wow, wow. Did these dung beetles come back though? No, it doesn't seem like it. Okay, I feel like we're going to have to attack them to get them to appear. So let's go ahead and just kind of punch in this area. I believe this is where one of them was. Oh, yep, there it is. Okay, so we hit the 50. And we've ruined its taming effectiveness, which is unfortunate, but we do have it back. And the other one is back too, but we didn't ruin the taming efficiency on that one. So let's just make sure we don't get hit by it. Let's let it cool down. And now we can go and feed you again, right? Yes, we can. You're at 40%. And we can start the process all over again with the other one. Okay, we've got our big level. The 125 is fully tamed up. Let's go ahead and throw it by the Cardo. Keep it nice and safe. There you go, sir. Don't need to follow me for the moment. And let's get another piece of poop here. Feed you. Okay, we've just got one more feed on this dung beetle, and then we can start bringing everybody back to base, which is uh, kind of amazing. I feel like we've done really well our first artifact, three dung beetles, a very successful trip, and boom. You've been tamed up, sir. Okay, all three of the dung beetles are back at the base, nice and safe. And uh, I want to kind of fill them all with poo, so what we're going to do is grab the trike and harvest a ton of berries. I also find that sentence very strange, and I'm kind of weirded out that I've said it out loud, but... We're going to fill some things with some poo, and we're just going to accept it, and it's going to be a thing. We really only need the stim berries, but that should be enough. We should have a couple stacks in here, so let's grab those off the trike. And are there any more? There are. Grab those. And this Paraceratherium has just been in my base the entire time. I don't know what it's doing. 
Are you just hanging out? You're making new friends? What level are you? You're level 40. That's not great. And where is our amazing Fiomia? I'm actually going to make a saddle for it real quick. So we can move it around with ease. Okay, let's go ahead and get that crafting. And we can move you nice and close to the greenhouse. So I believe that the dung beetles just have an area of effect. And if something poops nearby, they will automatically pick it up. Like this guy has poop. You already have some poop. And you are full on poop. Holy moly. I'm just going to throw a bunch of stim berries into you. And we're going to make you poop a lot. All the poop with the Fiomia. I love these things. They're little poop machines. And it's all getting picked up. It's just disappearing in front of our eyes. And the dung beetles should now be chock full. Right? Oh, no. You only have two. Are you picking up all of it? Oh, you got some. I had no idea they could go so far overweight. And these guys should be pretty self-sustaining. We just have to kind of wait. And they're going to make fertilizer in their inventory. And they're also going to make us oil. So that's going to be very nice to have but in order for these guys to produce they do need to be on wander so let's go ahead and turn that on we'll get you on wander you and the last one and hopefully even though they're overweight they're still going to be able to do what they need to do and if not we'll kind of have to take a bunch of the poop out of them so they can start producing I'm honestly really excited for them to get some fertilizer because then we can plant the crops and we can move into the uh, kibble making stages, which is extremely great. I cannot wait. So before we end off this episode, I actually want to do a little alpha hunting. So we're going to take out the Carno. I'm actually going to clear your inventory before we do that, though, because you are chock full of goodies. And the reason I want to do some alpha hunting is I'd like to get some better tools and potentially some better crossbows because i feel like we need that in our life a raptor just ran by the base it's killing a fiomia i have a feeling that's going to come back and bite us in the butt maybe oh yeah it's circling back around okay we're just going to jump on the carno real quick from here raptor there you go fiomia i've saved you you're welcome but i'm also just going to eat you and Take your hide, so unfortunate for you. Not your best day. Okay, let's go see what kind of alphas we can find. There's just a micro raptor and a giganto swimming around, trying to kill each other. That's kind of great. And the giganto won, which I do appreciate because screw micro raptors. Oh no, there's an actual micro raptor coming for me. No, we don't want that. We don't need that in our life. Oh, please just kill it. Thank you. I really don't like those things. They make me very sad. Okay, I think this is an alpha raptor in front of me in the bushes. It should be anyway. Everybody is boosted up. So let's kind of just head into the mosh pit. Oh, wow. That is a lot. Holy moly. Okay. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is really bad. This is really bad. That's a lot of raptors. Uh, let's just get in the water. Okay. Okay. Why were there so many raptors? That's way too many raptors. What in the world? Okay, we killed the alpha. Uh, I do want to see if we got anything for that. We got an apprentice simple pistol. Yeah, I'll take that. Some apprentice clothes. And there's a truodon on it. Why are you attacking us? Oh, another one? What? Guys, I just want to look at my loot. Just give me a moment. And there's another raptor? Okay. Can we have a moment? Thank you. Uh, did we get anything else? No. So we just got that apprentice simple pistol, basically. The apprentice cloth pants are okay. They're whatever. And of course, we've got the alpha raptor claw. That was absolutely ridiculous. That was like a legion of raptors. Ooh, there's a blue drop right here. I definitely want to grab this up. Uh, hopefully it'll be better than the last one that we got. And it is slightly worse. Yeah, it's not amazing. Uh, we could probably throw out most of this stuff. The tripwire alarm I'm going to grab just for fun. 
Uh, but we can throw out the two structure pieces. Okay, um, there's two alpha raptors in front of me, but there's also a spino attacking them and a rex over there. So I want to be a little careful. Oh no, a micro raptor then? That's when I get micro raptored? Okay. Um, uh, we need to get on you. No. All right, we need to get back there as fast as possible because I have a feeling our Carno is going to get destroyed without me backing up and attacking the raptors. It's going to take a lot more damage. Please be okay. Oh, there's a Spino headed straight for my Carno. Oh, get out of the water. Get out of the water, Carno. How we doing? Oh, we're so close to being dead. Okay. Um, we just need to run. I'm sorry, was that a Rex baby we just saw as well? This is uh, not what we want. No, another Micro Raptor? No, 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 come on. Come on. Uh, don't kill me. Let me just get on the car note. No! A Rex came over? My Carno is definitely dead. Okay, I've got my stuff back. All we need to do now is make it back to the house. I'm so freaking sad that the Carno died. Honestly, really cheesed off at these micro raptors. Like, they're actually the worst. We only died because of you. I want you to know that. It's this level 25, too. This is the exact micro raptor. We're 100% going to kill him. If we could not get ruined by him. He's destroying us. Oh, no. Please don't kill me. Thank you. Oh, and there's two alpha raptors on me now. And we're going to definitely die. Okay. All right. So I'm just going to keep running and grabbing my stuff and eventually make it back to the base. So I think I'm going to end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. And if you have, remember to smash that like button. And remember to subscribe as well because it seriously helps me out. It really does. We made some great progress today, even though we lost the Carno. We've got three dung beetles who are going to be producing a ton of fertilizer for us. And we also completed our first cave and got the first artifact. So I'm still happy. We're definitely going to need to get some more carnivores very, very soon. Um, but yeah, have a good one. See ya.